Find the equation of a line that goes through negative 2, 7 and 3, negative 8. Write the answer in slope-intercept form. So first remember, slope-intercept form is y equals mx plus b, where m is your slope and b is your y-intercept. So the first thing we're going to look for is my slope. So I'm going to write m equals, now the formula for slope is y sub 2 minus y sub 1 over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. So I'm going to call this x1, y1, x2, y2. This is my first point, my second point. It really doesn't matter which one you call point 1 and point 2. You're going to get the same answer. So y sub 2, it kind of wrote over it, but it's negative 8, minus y sub 1, which is 7, divided by x sub 1, which is 3, minus x sub 1, which is a negative 2. So now I'm going to simplify. Negative 8 minus 7 is negative 15. 3 minus a negative 2 is the same thing as 3 plus 2, which is 5. Negative 15, negative 15 divided by 5 is negative 3. So here's my slope. So let me write my equation. y equals, now m is negative 3, x plus b. Well, I still need to find my y-intercept. But I happen to know an x and a y. Where? Either one of these points. Let's use the first one. In the first point, 7 is my y equals negative 3. And x in my first point is negative 2. If I use y, I have to use this x. If I use this y, I'd have to use this x plus b. Okay, so we have the equation written out. So 7 equals negative 3 times negative 2 is 6 plus b. I want to figure out my y-intercept. I need to get b by itself. So I'm going to subtract 6 from both sides of the equation. So 1 equals b. So here's my y-intercept. So let me write out the formula one last time. y equals mx plus b. Well, I know my slope and I know my y-intercept. So my answer is going to be y equals negative 3x plus 1.